Okay, guys, if something seems a little fishy about today's episode, it's because we're bringing you five crazy, cool, epic, awesome, funny, weird, wild, unexpected, true <gasps> facts about the creepiest fish in the sea. Number five, the blob sculpin. Often called blobfish or ugly by me, it has a face only a mother could love. It's found in portions of the North Pacific Ocean that have really deep water. Their body is covered in tiny spikes to protect them from predators, but they're not exactly appetizing anyway. Number four, the deep sea viper fish. This fish wouldn't be able to close its mouth if it wasn't able to curl its long fangs behind its head. Man, even braces couldn't fix those chompers. Those fangs are great for catching prey, but they make it hard for them to kiss each other without getting tangled together. Aw, how sweet. Careful, guys. Number three, the knife-toothed sawfish. Despite its gritty name, the knife-toothed sawfish isn't actually a hardened killing machine. In fact, the big spikes on the snout that give the fish its name aren't teeth at all. They're actually modified scales, which might be less dangerous, but isn't any less menacing. They use the scales to sift through the sand for prey and to stun fish before they eat them. Oh, and they're also the best lumberjacks in the ocean. Timber! Number two, the hatchet fish. This freaky looking fish lives towards the bottom of the sea, so its eyes are positioned to look up for food almost constantly. Those big peepers are also light sensitive, which helps the hatchet fish identify the size of the potential prey during the night. They're usually pretty small, only about four inches long. Hmm, maybe that's why they look so scared all the time. Aw, guys, it'll be okay. And finally, the number one creepiest fish in the sea, the deep sea angler. You probably recognize the deep sea angler from its now famous role in Finding Nemo. It turns out it doesn't use the light to read at night. Instead, it uses the small light on the top of its head to attract prey in the deep dark. It also makes a convenient nightlight after the angler fish watches a scary movie and can't fall asleep. Well, there you have it. Those are our five totally eerie, totally true facts about the creepiest fish in the sea. I just want to let everyone know that you can get even more Five Facts hosted by Sarah Rowe and Josh Carlin by watching DreamWorks TV on Go90. Just click the link in the description below to get the Go90 app on your smartphone or tablet now. Always get a parent's permission before downloading anything from the internet. Who wants the absolute creepiest fish you've ever heard of? Let us know by commenting below and remember to subscribe to DreamWorks TV for new videos every day. Okay, I've got my turn of the century metal scuba gear, and I'm ready to dive into the briny deep. All right, lower me in. Okay, okay, it's pretty dark down here. I'm just looking around till I see a shark. Gonna swim away. <laughs> <laughs>